Yo, what is up, YouTube? Uh, obviously, I want to cheer. And we're back with more Call of Duty. Um, so, previously, I'm still continuing the last mission. Because I really suck at this. And I keep dying. Hey, if you guys want me to do, um, realistic, which I'll probably die every second. Then, uh, if I get 100 likes on this video, I'm gonna do realistic. So I'm not gonna be talking them all off to this point. So uh, enjoy the video. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just take a second. Deep breath in. Tell me what happened. I was back in memories. The grunts. I, I lived it all again. What's it's happening to me? Shit. You know how your senses can trigger vivid memories? Make you think of sounds, sights, words from songs. Make you think of stuff you haven't thought of in years. D and I can make that a lot more visceral. Little glitches on your optics, little whispers in your ear. The shit happens. The doctor can straighten it out. You just need to recalibrate your meds. Trust me, you're gonna be fine. So what now? Oh, right now, you're gonna interface with that console. As soon as you plug in, you'll be able to extract and process the information in a heartbeat. Got it. They had a man on the inside, at Coalescence. He would have been able to supply them with everything they needed to bypass the security on the train. To botch the assault, man, it took six hours for the ZSF to get that information. How come? Train go boom. Took you just six minutes. Yeah, it would have been five. We haven't freaked out when you saw those robots. So what happens now? Now we go find the son of a bitch. Tipped off by his terrorist pals. The mole was ready for him. He had heavy duty combat grunts with him. Once again, the Zerk security force got their asses handed to him. Out come. Train go boom. We lost him. He slipped away. You remember Specialist Sarah Hall? She's gonna walk you through the next part. Trust her, do exactly what she says. I trained her myself. She's an intelligence expert from back when that actually meant something. Before DNI, you had to read books. In the academy, Taylor made me read a lot of them. Well, some knowledge is worth earning. Appreciate it. And that takes time. Time is something we don't always have. Okay, New Blood. From this point on, the simulation deviates from actual events. Not that it's gonna feel any less real. Use your imagination. Sending his location to your HUD. Come on now, pick up the trail. Check your fire, civilians are not targets. Scared, not sitting behind a computer. 
He can only be controlling them if he's got a DNI too. You're a smart one, new blood. I'll give you that. Son of a bitch is still moving. Use that billboard to get over the maglev train. so well, huh? I reckon our suspect has about 15 seconds left before he shakes hands with the Grim Reaper. You can't let that happen. Not before you get the information we need. I don't think he's in any condition to talk. He doesn't have to. He has a DNI. Buried beneath layers of security protocols, the subject's DNI records cam footage of the user's past experiences. In extreme circumstances, it is possible to extract that information by force. You'll be able to push deep into the subject's memories, their thoughts, even their subconscious. You could learn everything we need to know about the terrorist plans. I'm sensing a but coming up somewhere. You should know. Not only will this procedure be deeply traumatic for the subject, but the associated subconscious interference will leave him brain dead dead believe me this is a bad way to go he's a dead man anyway besides he's a fucking terrorist A few minutes ago, you knew nothing. What do you know now? I know where they are. They're using the old train tunnel to plan their attack. Hmm. But you just learned that your DNI took the ZSF weeks to uncover. What do you think I'm gonna say next? Outcome. Train go boom. It's good to know you can make tough decisions when you have to. I think it's time we moved on. ZSF finally tracked down the terrorists to this location. For their sake, 
I really wish they hadn't. You're still here, huh? Pity. I bet Diaz a hundred that you'd be dead by now. Funny man, Specialist Peter Moretti. He's gonna help you understand how much of a badass motherfucker you are now. But remember, we still don't have the last piece of the puzzle. How in the hell they got the explosives on board the train? So we're clear? When this is over, you owe me a hundred. Back to business. As you know, one of the perks of being Black Ops is having access to the latest in experimental weaponry. Firearms may be your go-to choice for a weapon in a fight. But with DNI, your mind truly is your greatest weapon. Let's do some damage. You got a new cyber ability to play with. Immolation. You can stick on those enemies ahead. He's toast. <laughs> Not bad, new blood. Using smoke grenade. Switching to your EV helps whenever you're blind, whether in the dark or in the smoke. How about that? Now you never have to worry about what's lurking in the darkness. Uh. Hostile bots coming through the wall. I got boss moving that rail car. Shred him. 